Hey guys, what's going on? It's your host Overlord Tico here, bringing you guys some more Dragon's Dogma, and this is the fight versus the Dragon Drake. And uh, hopefully, if you've been playing Dragon's Dogma, if you've kind of been exploring around like the whole uh, world of Dragon's Dogma, that you have might have stumbled upon a, a, a woods that's called the Devil Fire Grove. I think that's the name of this uh, the woods over here. And if you go inside those woods, pretty much that spe that special small part of the of the map that's just called the Devil Fire Drop, that's just these small woods, is run by one dragon, and one dragon is called uh, Scott. I guess it's called Drake. And um, this dragon is actually a very tough opponent. It's like the toughest opponent you can encounter so far in the game to fight against, and uh, it's actually pretty tough to go against. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the stats I got for going up against this guy. Both of my main characters, my main character and my main pawn Alexis, both of them at level 38. And my two characters, that my two extra pawns that I enlisted from two people online, they're both over level 50. So, you know, I'm, I'm on an average of like level 45 right there in this battle. And it still took me about 9 minutes to beat this battle. So, you know, I actually looked around for, uh, I've read around some other posts right before I put this video up. I've read around some other posts online of people that have fought this dragon. I've, seen people, I've read a post of people that fought the dragon for like over 30 minutes and they still died or like the dragon would like fly away because the dragon was losing like the battle takes long and then the dragon sees that he's dying that he's losing after a really long battle so he just flies away but in my case this is only my, my second time facing him because my first time I faced him also around level 20 my two characters recruited were about level 35 I was an average of like level 28, 27 so this time I'm, on, I'm an average of like pretty much 15 levels over that so I'm a lot stronger than I was before, you know, pretty much about tw almost twice as strong as I was before. So I'm a lot stronger and I decided to go ahead and go to this forest and try my hand at this Dragon Drake. And uh, you know, he, he he actually went down a lot faster than I thought he would because from the post that I read I thought he was going to take longer to kill. Because apparently not that many people have been able to kill him, I guess you got to beat him around level 40 to beat him on average. But uh, one thing you got to beat him, if you, you want to beat him, if you got to beat him and you want to beat him, because you know there's people that it's not, it's not necessary. It's, it's not forced. It's not like a dragon you're forced to fight. I don't think so. At least there hasn't been come. I haven't come across a quest that requires you to kill the Drake. But if you want to kill him just because you want to get him out of the way and you want to be able to roam through that side of the woods like without being attacked all the time, then I recommend killing him. And if you want to kill him, I recommend only attacking his heart and switching all your characters' uh, spells. Especially your mages, your majors and your sorcerers, I'd recommend switching their spells all to ice because uh, the drake is weak against ice and if you hit him with ice it does a lot more damage than any other element. Especially if your character's got fire then that doesn't help at all because he's kind of like made of fire so you know if you're using fire, I'd really recommend not using fire against this guy because it's just going to be useless. You just switch all your characters using ice in which my case my characters had uh, fire, uh, ice affinity on them and they had the two strongest uh, Ice spells. I mean, this ice affinity and the two strongest ice spells on both of them. And uh, for the recruited mage, for the recruited mage that actually had the healing spell, and for my, for my actual main pawn that was a sorcerer. So you know that's pretty much this battle. And uh, you know just keep go ahead and enjoy the rest of this video. You just watch the whole battle. At the end of the video, I actually sh uh, pick up all the drops, all the droppables that he has, all the things that he drops, and I pick them up so you guys can see exactly what they are. And uh, you know just. Enjoy the rest of the video. Let me know how if you have encountered this fight yet. Uh, how did it go? If you encountered it, have you beat him yet? Are you gonna try and beat him sometime later? Uh, and did you think that he was a challenge? Because to me, he was a challenge, but not not, not as much as I thought. You know, because this is my second time, and I beat him my second time. Even though it's like over 15 levels from before, but you know, it seems like the first time I fought him was a lot more of a challenge. But I've got I've gotten a lot stronger since. But anyways, this will be the only video I'll be bringing you guys today of Dragon's Dogma because I think it's like a special video. I think a lot of people want to see this fight, so I'm just going to keep this one video away. People can just see this is my last uploaded video. And tomorrow I'm going to upload like another 5 to 6 Dragon Dogma videos from a lot of other quests I've done and things I've found. And by the way, I, I always keep having to pick up my teammates. They keep dying constantly. The most annoying thing is that the dragon can actually possess uh, one of your characters and have them attack you. So he kept possessing my character that my my warrior character and he kept attacking my other two for a little bit like pretty much like 30 seconds to a minute so that was kind of annoying but anyways that is all guys and hopefully you enjoyed this video you know let me know in the comments what you think and uh, I guess I'll just catch you guys later it's peace out
first. Any time. I'll take that. If you're tired, rest. Icon grows better able to serve the more we learn. <laughs> 